I noticed that there are a lot of crypto or token economics 101 courses, but a lot of people are looking for one or two course. And since I've been doing so much research in defining token economics, I thought I might as well start sharing that in a, a more deep dive course. So here I am telling, giving an update on what I've been doing and how you can get involved. So this is token, this is going to be a token economics 201 course, and it will take 10 chapters. And so this is what it's going to look like. The objectives is to understand token economics of token ecosystems from a 201 level. So really going to have bigger deep dives, looking at an overview of the variables to consider in your token ecosystem and how to get started on a more technical level. So it's going to take a total of 10 sessions. And it is, in these 10 sessions, uh, it will take about one hour per session. And if there some, some of the courses will be updated. So as long as you, you have paid for one of paid for the specific thing and it's updated, you'll be notified and you can watch them again to be updated. So the first lesson is introduction to token economics to build the foundation and to build the introduction level so that it's quicker to scale and accelerate in learning. So there are a lot of different uh, one-on-one uh, token economics out there and not everyone is teaching the, the same content. In general, it's quite similar, but some of them are very focused on, on uh, the valuation aspect. So I'm coming from a point of view of the, the economics aspect, okay? So we're gonna have a few things that will be in the, the course or the content. Human glossary, introduction to economics, uh, token economics versus crypto economics, the overall design and picture of the, the framework as well as the design process. In lesson two, we'll look deeper into the token economics overview. So we're gonna look at seven wonders of economics and the case studies. So this will be seven wonders of regular economics and seven ones of security economics. The evolution of economics and how we are today at token economics, um, coordination and incentives, outcomes and constraints, as well as design goals in general. Then we're gonna start going deeper into very specific design pillars. So the design, the, the, the framework that we're talking about here, the token economics framework has designed has three different pillars. You've got market design, mechanism design, and token design. So in lesson three, we go into market design. We we'll look at the different introduction to it, different variables, as far well as a case study specific to market design. In lesson four, we're gonna have mechanism design one. So the introduction of that, as well as the different governance and resolution mechanism solutions. Lesson two, we we'll look at mechanism design two, and we we'll look at non-incentive uh, non-financial incentives and mechanism design three we're going to look at the different structures like oracles tcrs and all the different kind of um, mechanisms and we're going to end it with case studies specific to mechanism design lesson seven we're going to kick start with the token the token design so token policy looking at um from a view of monetary economics as well as the core concepts they're going to have a human glossary very specific to token design kind of keywords. Token design two in lesson eight on token policy two. So we look at curated markets and token bonding calls. Token design three, we're gonna look at architecture and financial incentives. And token design four, this is where we're gonna end our lesson. We look at a case study based on token design and how does the function token business model, how does the, the token function, token utility and token business model affects the variables to choose from. So. In the first lesson, we have, so to conclude, in the first lesson, we have this big uh, framework with all the different variables. And in the subsequent uh, two to 10 lessons, so subsequent nine lessons, uh, we'll go we'll deep dive into all of them. And then how do you know what you need for your, to design your different token? And what is the, the lessons behind all of these token economics? So this is it. These are the 10 lessons. And if you're interested, the first lesson is already out, which is the introduction part. So it's really introduction to, to Token Economics 201. And if you're interested, just drop and drop your email below or I'll send you the link where you can sign up for the course. And till then, I'll see you. Bye.